animals, like humans, are suffering from the impacts of climate change. Some impacts are direct and easy to understand, like loss of habitat. But the climate can also have more complex and bizarre consequences. Take Richardson's ground squirrels, commonly called gophers, a common pest of the West. According to Manitoba Research, the heat is killing their love life. In 2010, when I looked at them, everything was really clear. All the instruments inside the animal were well developed. But when I looked in 2012, I, there was no sperm in, in so many of the animals. But it was also 26 degrees out. And I just wasn't expecting it. And so then we started to try to look at what are, were the factors that influenced this. The heat was the key. Males had come out of hibernation, as usual, driven by internal hormone cues to set up territories and get ready for the breeding season. But females rely more on environmental cues like the rising temperatures, and they woke up too early due to the heat wave. They were ready to roll, but the males were rushed. And I watched while I was out there, I had saw males that were courting females that subsequently I found had no sperm. So the, the males were trying, they thought they were good to go, but they were not. The heat had disrupted the delicate dance that brings male and female squirrels together each spring. This is an example of what biologists call phenological mismatch. Phenology is the scientific word for what we might call natural cycles. It's the study of the link between biological phenomenon, like breeding or migration, and environmental ones like the weather. Why it's called a phenological mismatch is that the cues and cycles of one individual or group start to mismatch with the other. So if you're looking at insects that need to pollinate flowers, if the insects come out at a different time because of weather and the flowers have already gone by, then they can't pollinate them. And in this case, it's within the same species because the two sexes use different cues to respond to their, their time of emergence from hibernation. This is bad news for the squirrels, as warm springs are becoming the norm. And Dr. Waterman is concerned that human-caused global warming may be having similar hidden impacts on many other animals and plants. Ground squirrels, maybe you don't think that they're important, but we know that their burrows have big impacts on the animals around them. We also know that everything likes to eat them, so they're really important for a healthy ecosystem. Even if they're not as big and sexy as a polar bear, they're still a really important organism in our environment.